Thanksgiving is a time for family and friends to gather, and one story in particular grabs the hearts of millions of people every year, and it's a story from right here in the valley. Yeah, we finally call it the Thanksgiving mix-up. The people involved call it a blessing. Linda Williams is live tonight with more. Linda, this is incredible. This is still going on. We just love this story. I love this story more than I love pumpkin pie at Thanksgiving, and that is saying a lot. Back in 2016, a young man named Jamal Hinton mistakenly received a message from a Mesa grandma. So they started back and forth. They realized that it was a mix-up, but eventually he accepted her gracious invitation to their Thanksgiving dinner. People love this story. He posted about it, and it blew up on social media. So here we are. Six years later, this is their seventh time getting together, and we, for one, are thankful this tradition is ongoing. This has your signature all over it. Yeah, the yeah. Crust. Something, something like it. <laughs> Bam. Family shenanigans while baking pumpkin pie on the day before Thanksgiving. This family, however, was created by a happy accident that happened six years ago. That's when Wanda Dench messaged her grandson about Thanksgiving plans. Jamal Hinton, who was 17 years old at the time, actually got that message. After establishing the mix-up, the Mesa grandma invited him to their Thanksgiving gathering anyhow. And Jamal, who was in high school at the time, decided to go to the holiday celebration, though he didn't know anyone there. I guess I, I kind of still am an outgoing person, uh, but I always try to make the most out of every uh, interaction that I go through. My husband and I were really friendly people. We just wrapped our arms around him and brought him in. Never occurred to me, he told me later, he was nervous about coming to my house. Yeah. And I'm like, well, what's there to be nervous about, you know? But he didn't know me either, so yeah. he didn't know if we were some crazy white people, is what he said. I and didn't I, say those words. Yes, you did. <laughs> I did not say those words. This was Jamal's first Thanksgiving with the Denches back in 2016. They've kept up the tradition every year and are making pumpkin pies ahead of this Thanksgiving feast. Wanda's husband, Lonnie, passed away in 2020 from COVID complications, but she says she knows he is thrilled they have kept the tradition that came from the Thanksgiving mix-up going. Well, my husband's very, very proud. He, uh, he adored Jamal and his girlfriend, Michaela, which I do too. He, he just knew that Jamal was special. From the, my husband could meet somebody and he just knew if they were an angel on earth. The two couldn't say much about their story grabbing the attention of movie producers at Netflix, but stay tuned. We hear there is a movie in the works about their Thanksgiving mix-up. Linda Williams, Fox 10 News.